Hello, everyone. Hello, universe. Hello to whoever finds this about me video. Welcome. You're going to learn a little bit about myself and a little bit about me being what I'm now entitling a fitness consultant and human design expert and how I help people fearlessly find their confidence. One, within their movement, two, within their life, and three, to transform everything about themselves. Hi, my name is Francis Young. I am a one, three generator and creator of the Fearless Project. And as I've mentioned, help millions of people already find the confidence that has been born into them and fearlessly. So a little bit about myself, uh, where to begin? As a 1-3 generator, I can go as far back as, you know, maybe the initial memories I think I can remember, or we can fast forward past life-changing pandemic and say where we are with human design and fitness. But we'll start with movement. I've been dancing since I was seven years old. I first started with Highland dancing, as that is part of my background, obsessed and then I fell into wanting to become a professional ballet dancer, then turned into having a Bachelor of Arts in with honors in dance from the School of Contemporary Dancers in Winnipeg, Manitoba, as well as the University of Winnipeg. I happened to find fitness in university when someone asked me to do a pull up and I couldn't do one. And I was really upset. This Leo son has always been trying to embrace her confidence and let that shine at all times. Uh, and if I can't do something, I get very upset. So then I went down the rabbit hole of learning how to do a pull-up, getting into a CrossFit gym alongside being a dancer. It was incredible. And I burnt myself out many times. Also one three for those human design nerds out there, the trial and error is real with a three in the profile. <laughs> After that, and after school, I ended up somehow just finding myself back in Ontario. I had dance contracts lined up. I just wasn't sure where life was going. The typical moment of, I went to school for this, and am I actually going to do this with my life? And wound up living in Toronto and working as a full-time personal trainer in under a year after graduating from university. And even though I went to school for dance, was now teaching a completely different thing, but still movement related. And now when I look back, I'm like, that was so correct for me in this bonkers way. So then we went down the rabbit hole of coaching in gyms, coaching in chiropractic offices, all of these different facets of how we can bring fitness and health to an individual and exploring so many avenues to try to say, what is my niche as a personal trainer? I became obsessed with feeling like I was inadequate enough. The confidence was high while coaching, but the confidence while internally speaking to myself about how am I gonna show up? How am I gonna make more money? How am I gonna live my life? Was always this deeper, deeper question that led me to opening a gym at 25. That led me to moving country and not sure what I was continuing to do, but just knowing that I had to move, becoming a fascial stretch therapist as well, knowing that, okay, I don't want to go back to like a school school, but we got to do school my way. Also, maybe potentially a very one, three trait. Uh, human design nerds, if you're watching, you can comment. <laughs> and uh and then realizing that I have all of this knowledge, but still don't know how I'm niching myself. Pandemic comes in, start working more online, move back to Toronto, loss, excitement, better emotional understanding, and then in pops human design. And we are now a fitness consultant to fully just break open the mold of what the fitness industry means as to how somebody loses 10 pounds, how somebody uh, has a better diet, how somebody knows that by going about their day in the way that they are designed to, and maybe only working out for whatever that workout is meant to be for them for 30 minutes is going to bring them to the next best thing in their life that is meant for them. 
whether that is for meant for them to be losing 10 pounds at that time or how they show up better for their family or how they show up better in their job or how they discard everything and move across the world because that's what is actually aligned for them at that time. By combining my knowledge of health and fitness with human design, which is a blueprint and a makeup of how we are energetically designed as humans to show up for ourselves and make decisions for ourselves in our life, you're going to have that fearless confidence that somehow I've always had and now is beaming out of me as a generator. And I know it is, and I want to say it out loud so that I can give you energy through this video. If you want to talk about health and fitness in a different way with someone who's tried everything and someone who has the knowledge and expertise to back it up, I can't wait to talk to you. Whether you're a dancer, a Pilates person, you've never done fitness before, or you've tried a million other things and you just don't like going to classes. I can help you at any point of your fitness journey, whether it is to coach you physically in movement uh, to learn how to snatch for the first time, or I'm giving you the pointers as to how energetically your energy fluctuates, how it's meant to interact with others, and how your body really wants to make decisions as opposed to trying to listen to the logical brain or someone on the street or something that you heard in a YouTube video. Uh, I'd love to chat with you and ultimately give you the fearless confidence that you already have inside you to live your life the way that you're meant to. And that's ultimately going to look very different from me. And I want that for you. So I hope you learned a little bit about myself, Francis, uh, without going down too much of my own rabbit holes. And I can't wait to meet you.